Young people, and most of us, get our information through our digital devices. This overabundance of information can be overwhelming. If we can't find trustworthy information, our democracy is at risk. Current approaches to digital literacy, especially outdated and lengthy lists of questions that appear on checklists, often don't work. People are fooled by slick modern website designs, content without spelling errors, pages without banner ads, sites that hide their real authors, and about pages where groups spin whatever tale they want to tell about themselves. All of these features can be easily manipulated and distorted. Our research has shown that many students have flawed assumptions about what makes a site reliable. The top-level domain, the three letters at the end of a URL, or that the first search result is always the best. Your students, even if they are digital natives, lack the skills to evaluate online content. They don't know what to believe. They have trouble distinguishing an ad from a news story and have difficulty identifying the organization behind a website. In 2014, the Stanford History Education Group conducted an 18-month study involving thousands of students. Middle school through college students struggled to perform basic evaluations of online content. In a follow-up, we observed how professional fact-checkers evaluated digital sources. Fact-checkers employed a strategy that we call lateral reading, leaving a site to research its reliability by opening up new tabs in their browsers. Students, on the other hand, wasted time on an unfamiliar site without first asking who's behind it but fact-checkers investigated an unfamiliar site by first going elsewhere, consulting the broader web to learn about who's behind the information they're consuming and whether to trust it. Our approach is based on what experts do to determine the quality of information. We've distilled fact-checkers' strategies and put them at the heart of our civic online reasoning, or core curriculum. Three questions guided fact-checkers' evaluation of sources. The core curriculum was developed by the Stanford History Education Group in partnership with MediaWise, the Pointer Institute, and the Local Media Association, with support from Google.org. The lessons and assessments are designed to help you teach students how to judge online information. Our materials are flexible, modular, and can be integrated across different subject matters. You can pick one or two of our lessons or teach all of them. Research conducted in real classrooms and rigorously peer-reviewed shows that the core curriculum works. And the results have been featured in publications all over the world. Our goal isn't to turn students into professional fact-checkers, but to equip them with skills that are easy to master and that will allow them to avoid their most common errors. When students are able to tell reliable sources from those that are untrustworthy, they are less likely to be manipulated, and they're better prepared to make informed decisions, both when they enter the voting booth and act in the world at large.